for the oily skin people other sunscreen which i am talking about is this oh now what exactly is this physical uh oh sorry the moment i put the sunscreen on i was like wow there is one more app where you can try the products for free hello everyone welcome back to your channel mom goody days and in today's video as you have seen in the title we are going to talk about the best sunscreens for the oily skin people you know we have got so many people who keep telling us like how important is wearing sunscreens but i've got like hundreds of reason to hate sunscreens firstly it does make me look like one ghost because of the white cast it gives and also it's so oily and greasy on the skin and feels so heavy on the skin and when you go out in the hot sun you're going to sweat like pig the other reason is that because it's heavy on the skin sometimes it might clog the pores and it even causes the acne and the fourth reason is that it makes us look even more darker and dull mm. finally the search for the best sunscreen is over and i'm going to show you like not one but two sunscreens which are going to give you solutions to all these problems i'm going to show you how the texture is i'm going to give you the review i'm going to put it on my skin you're going to see everything in detail and let's get started the moment i put the sunscreen on i was like wow and i'm sure you'll not regret buying them and the sunscreen which i'm talking about is the sunscreen from the rickwell reason i'm calling it the best sunscreen is that because firstly it's like water and sweat resistance it works beautifully under makeup it's non comedogenic that means it doesn't clog the pores and i had no issues with this i'm going to show you how this uh, texture looks like so this is how the texture looks like it's so silky smooth and it's make it also makes your skin so beautiful bright and also velvet kind of a skin I'm glad i found one so coming to the protection part it is spf 50 it's pa plus 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 it's also going to give you protection from uva and uvb to make it very easy for you uva rays can cause aging in you and the uvb rays can cause tan in you so all you have to do is buy something which is a broad spectrum one and the other sunscreen which i'm talking about is the cures one this is so good i'll tell you the moment you put it it's going to brighten your skin it's also spf 50 it's also has got uva and uvb protection and it's a mattifying mineral sunscreen this one the requel one it's a chemical sunscreen and the curious one is a physical sunscreen so what exactly is this physical sunscreen chemical sunscreen to make it very simple let me tell you for physical sunscreen it is the zinc oxide and the titanium dioxide which actually does the job physical sunscreens basically they reflect the light and that way they are protecting us while the chemical sunscreen they actually absorb it and then they convert it into a different form say some thermal energy and that's how it works and coming to the ingredients part uh, i'll put up somewhere here on the screen so that you can go take a look and whenever i see this ingredients list you know it just flies off it feels like one latin french for me uh, i mean we don't understand so i always thought you know there should be one app wherein we give our favorite skincare product and this has to tell us in return whether this particular product is safe or how unsafe it is so which ingredient is causing that issue how simpler and easier would our life be but i have a good news for you there is one instagram page which does this job for you she is a mommy instagram page name is the safety test you can ask her to review any of your favorite skincare products and she's going to tell you everything about the ingredients thing and she's also going to 
give some safety star she has also mentioned these two as a favorite sunscreen and no doubt why they are favorite Riquel has got an ingredient called octinoxate so I wouldn't suggest this to be used by expecting and the breastfeeding mommies I'm going to put this on my face and one half I'm going to put Riquel sunscreen and the other half I'm going to put Cure sunscreen you're going to see how the texture is and how does it look on the skin the Riquel one has got a very smoother application it it does glide on your face while cures it's it's not very smooth but yeah it does beautifully blends into your skin and it's going to look absolutely fantastic and it it does make your skin bright and that is something i really really like about it before you step out in the sun or uh, make sure you apply the sunscreens before like 20 minutes before and make sure if you're out in the sun reapply the sunscreen every two hours and i always suggest always always suggest to wear a moisturizer underneath sunscreen so first wear a moisturizer and then alone uh, put the sunscreen because sunscreens are meant to sit on the skin and not penetrate into the skin so that way when you're putting the moisturizer it's going to lock and other care you have to take is whenever you put a sunscreen definitely you will have to remove it very well once you're at home so how are you going to remove i basically follow double cleansing method like i use a cleansing balm and then go ahead with a face wash but a simple uh, washing your face twice using the face wash i think that should actually help and where you can buy this sunscreen the recoil sunscreens you can get it in amazon or you can also buy it from their site it costs you around like 6.95 rupees curious one you can buy it in their website or you can also buy it in a site called vanity wagon i'll put that in the description section and this costs you around like 450 rupees in fact i got it for around like 290 rupees because there was a 30 percent sale there is one more app where you can try the products for free fact that you can try many products for free because they'll have some six trial points and based on the number of points associated with that particular product you can go ahead and try and the app name is called smitten if you ask me if it's better than the very famous lash shield sunscreen in my opinion yes because um lash shield sunscreen is actually quite greasy on my skin when compared to these two so i prefer these two i was a sports person all the time even in school times and in corporate also i have played i'm a sports person and i used to be always on ground and back then nobody told how important is sunscreen and in fact whenever i wore sunscreen i wouldn't i never liked it because of the white cast it used to give us but trust me these two sunscreens are like 10 on 10 and you're gonna love it if you're someone who doesn't like sunscreens go ahead and invest on these i'm sure you're gonna fall in love with sunscreens oh with that we have come to the end of the video i hope you liked the video so please give me a thumbs up and also subscribe to my channel and also do share it among your mommy friends and yeah i'm gonna meet you guys in the next video until then as i always say Cherish every moment of your motherhood. Take care. See ya. Bye-bye.